Hidden footage leaked has scream as Meg slapped at his face at polo match as he refused to kiss her. So many human beings perceive Megan as an attention seeker in precise she shared an awkward moment lifting a polo trophy after a win in the California sunshine. Moreover, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle confirmed uncommon PDA as they kissed at a polo match. However, a shocking clip going viral shows Meghan slapping at Harry's face when he refused to kiss her in public. Meghan wanted journalists to seize the moment she may also be seeking attention. However, she simply fails to get it now and most humans are just definitely bored. In accordance to the clip, Meghan not only slapped Harry but also dug his cheek with a finger. Her gaze glared at Harry as if to kill him maybe they may get into a fight soon. Recently, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, according to what was reported by In Touch Weekly, have already decided to divorce, but they would like to wait for the end of the coronation to be able to do it and to prevent the media from focusing on them and not on King Charles III. Furthermore, the Duchess of Sussex would have seen a potential that would have earned her millions of dollars vanish due to some statements written in Spare the Minor. It seems that soon fans of the Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, aka the Rebel Dukes, will soon have to say goodbye to their favorites. According to what was reported by In Touch Weekly, Meghan Markle not only would not agree to follow the second son of King Charles III in London to make a common front against some tabloids, but she would have already communicated hers to her husband intention to divorce immediately after coronation of King Charles III. The former American actress, according to some rumors, would like to avoid they air another clamor about their couple, choosing to part ways since Prince Harry before and thus causing an earthquake which would cloud the coronation of King Charles III. But what would have led her to make this irremediable and definitive decision? Well, behind her there seems to be yet another rudeness made by her husband, or rather, future ex-husband, towards her. Apparently, inside of Spare the Minor, the shocking autobiography written by Prince Harry that catapulted general attention to the Dukes of Sussex, there is a sentence relating to the drug use by the second son of King Charles III, which would not only shame the hell out of it Meghan Markle, but even would have done them lose millions of dollars it's done vanish its chance to get involved in politics, remember that the new presidential elections will start this year in the United States. In short, not really a trivial deal, but this seems to have been the classic straw that broke the camel's back after cashing in a long string of failures, from her career as an actress, in fact never took off, to the far from idyllic relationships with the English royal family, passing through the loss of numerous friends on American soil and the hatred that seems ever more tangible towards him and those of Prince Harry.